Not every country experiences positive population growth. This topic video looks at population decline, which affects a growing number of countries, especially those in Eastern Europe. So can you name a country whose population is declining or shrinking? Well, here's the data for 2021. These were the countries with the fastest growth of population decline in that year. The Cook Islands suffered a 2.46 decline of population. The American Samoa, more than 2%. And actually, if you look at the data here for 2021, uh, there were five European Union countries with a significant population decline. Croatia, Bulgaria, and then the three Baltic states, Estonia, Lithuania and Latvia. Indeed, Latvia has suffered significant depopulation. In other words, negative population growth. Indeed, Latvia's resident population is 30% smaller than it was in 1990. And the estimate is that by 2050, numbers of population will be in decline in over half of Europe's 52 countries. Here's the data. The European Union population has declined for the second year in a row. Uh, now down to 446 million people. If we look at the data here, the evidence suggests that one of the major factors is a significant fall in the crude rate of natural population change. It's now negative. Clearly in 2020, we have to think about the impact of the COVID pandemic on the size of the population. COVID in particular caused tens of thousands of deaths across the European Union. Uh, but also there's the, the aspect of the economic crisis that uh, causes people to leave countries. The Baltic States being a good example. And the net outward migration, especially of younger people, uh, from countries where economic prospects and job security and the types of jobs available are not necessarily what young people want. Japan is another good example to use of population decline. Indeed, Japan has the highest average age in the world. And you can see the population in Japan by age groups here from 2000, including a projection through to 2030, population clearly there in decline. Now, one of the key issues that causes a falling population is a low level of fertility. So let's just spend a moment thinking about a key concept, which is replacement level fertility. Replacement level fertility is the level of female fertility at which a population exactly replaces itself from one generation to the next. And in high income advanced countries, replacement level fertility can be taken as requiring an average of 2.1 children per woman. Well, here's the data on global fertility from 2010 to 2020. And you can see the average number of children born to one woman whilst being of childbearing age has fallen from 2.52 in 2010 to 2.39 in 2020. In fact, according to the data, published by the World Bank and the United Nations, two-thirds of the world's population now live in countries with a birth rate below the 2.1 births per woman necessary for natural replacement. So clearly population decline is an important issue to be aware of, and it's linked to ageing population, which we'll look at in another topic video.